So happy Thursday. Here's a random photo of juice. I am writing for a class and I need y'all to help me out. If you are not setting tangible goals in your why not? What's the hurdle that's getting in the way? So I wanted to know from like real people who are in my sphere, what is the problem if you don't have goals? Why do you not have them? So John says, I lack general business discipline. I think a lot of creatives do. At least I hope I'm not the only one. And he is not the only one, including me. I lack discipline like crazy because if you know anything about the Enneagram, I am a type seven. We are chaotic mess dreamers who are really good at dreaming big, but really bad at putting the processes in place. So my goal setting processes super duper help me um, to be able to stay on track all throughout the year and not just like go in a million different directions and forget what the real purpose is um, in my business. Nick says he has a lack of time. He has a lot of goals, but he feels like he never has the chance to catch up and work on the steps for them. So like if the goal is to book 10 schools, the reality is he's got to make the marketing packet. He's got to prospect 100 schools to be able to get the 10 schools. He's got to make 50 presentations, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, right? So that is part of this where you're going to be able um, to forecast out your seasons on a spreadsheet and like put in how much you think each of those are going to make. I'm going to show you in a couple of slides away, but um, that's really going to help you be able to forecast what you've got and figure out what you still need to be able to hit your goals. Going to kind of make that less overwhelming, I think. Kim says time and all of the stuff that she has to process. Process, she means um, do knockouts and get the files made, get them up on the computer and everything. She has two full-time staff, but she's still the one processing. Why am I not delegating? <laughs> because it's easier if I just do it myself and I don't have time to train them to do it. Um, with volume photography particularly, I am super passionate about hiring employees. If you're gonna get to the point where you're doing a million dollars in sales, you have to have to have to have support staff that you are not looking over their shoulder. You gotta hire real adults, pay them a living you know, wage, what they would make at any other job, um, and you gotta have them 40 hours a week because that's the only way that you're gonna get people um, that you don't have to be constantly looking over their work and constantly feeling like you have to have the pulse on every single piece of your business um, so that you can focus on the most important high level things. 